What's going on everybody? Thanks for tuning in to another Dyslexic Reacts. Today I'm going to be checking out a round that includes two of our previously watched kickback battle competitors. We have KBA and PSN on one side versus Bonzo and Epos on the other. I've seen Epos just in, actually I think for the first time, in Delo's recent UK beatbox cipher and was pleasantly surprised. Have not heard of Bonzo, so not sure entirely what to expect here. But um, as always, thanks for the suggestions in the comments. Got a lot of good feedback in my last video. And uh, we'll go ahead and get right into this video. So let's get started. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back for the second top four battle. We have Bonzo and Epos versus PSN and KBA. I already do. Oh, okay. Oh, so this is the first team loop station I've watched. Do they both make music together? Or is it two separate, like one does one round, one does the other? So far, it's just PSN. <laughs> I just noticed Epos is sleeping in his bed. So like this is what I expected out of PSN. This is so <laughs> nice touch. I assume that's one of the other competitors. Oh, Josh O too. So I'm, I'm gonna pause that because there wasn't much time. It was very, it was a very loud and non-stop, like full sound 
just like f full sound, like my whole head filled with sound. I, I don't know how else to describe it other than it was just a very full sound design. Um, so there wasn't much room for me to talk, it felt. Um, so obviously that was insane. Uh, not the, it's like, and this is where I feel like maybe I don't always convey things perfectly in my facial reactions because there may be times where I like open my mouth to like a drop, like things like that. And like they're genuine reactions, uh, be, but it's more like the dr a, a drop is much more like for me, it's the heaviness of it that makes me like make those faces like the griminess or the dark, like the unexpectedness um, for PSN. I'm more just in a constant amazement of like confusion where I don't quite understand how he's doing what he's doing. And if you read through the comments down here while it was going through it all, other loopers who are in the kickback battle also don't seem to understand how he's doing it. And I mentioned, I think in my video, I may have just said it in the comments of my previous video, that I've seen Shin and Shazam react to him as, and said he's the only looper that they get that feeling that they got when they first saw someone looping. Like, that feeling of wonder, like, how is this being done by a person's mouth? And after getting skilled at looping both of them can pretty much just watch someone loop and instantly know how to do it it may not be as good because they don't have the time and practice or as fast but they can pick out the different effects um for the most part whereas when they watch psn they seem to just kind of turn back into a looper at my level where you really aren't skilled at it you just know that it exists and that it has filters on it and you're just kind of like He's pressing a lot of buttons, and there are noises coming out that I never saw him put a mic to his face for. Which is something that, when, like, analytically looking at the loop station and, like, judging their skill comes out a lot more. Like, I, I had a comment exchange with someone and explained this a bit better, or at least in more words, because I don't want to take up too much time here. But basically... If, if I'm judging based off of who has a better mastery of the RC505 Mark II or even the RC505 in general, I, I mean, I think it's without a question that PSN is the hands-down winner across the board there. Um, but the rounds he put out for the last quarterfinal for me weren't as interesting as something like this. Um, and I think a large part of that is the language barrier. I don't speak port Portuguese, nor do I understand it. I know I, I can hear because it has some similarities to Spanish. So there's a few words I can pick out because I took three years of Spanish, but that was like in 2007. So that knowledge is far gone, but I can like hear some common words and understand them but that the reason i bring that up is for me when music has lyrics that's what the most important part of the song is to me i really listen to the lyrics and try to understand what message the artist is trying to convey and i more use the instrumental as a mood setter so i think the the instrumental should uh accommodate the emotions trying to be conveyed through the lyrics and when I can't understand the lyrics, that kind of takes a lot of it out for me. So there were a few things going negative for PSN in my reactions. But I do just want to add now that I have uh, realized that some people may not know my full thoughts without going into them, obviously, and wanting to not discredit him in any way. I do just want to call out the fact that I do agree that he is one of the most talented, if not the most talented loopers out there when it comes to the mastery of his device. But 
for me, it was more just the style of the music that didn't hit as hard for me. And that's why I went towards, um, I just blanked, Kristoff. That being said, let's go back to this battle. Um, I didn't came into this not knowing what to expect. Didn't realize it was going to be one person, then the other, then one person, then the other. At least that's my assumption now that it was just PSN. So that's interesting. I thought it was going to be kind of like tag team loop uh, uh, beatboxing where two people work together against two other people who are working together like at the same time. But anyways, I don't want to waste too much more time. So let's go ahead and I'm probably going to play through most of this. I really just wanted to call out that stuff about PSN because it seemed like there was a lot of confusion in the comments. Um, but yeah, let's see what the other side, I'm guessing EPOS, but maybe Bonzo will do. It is time. Wow, what an amazing uh, yeah, round. Weather was IC505. But yes, Bonzo oh, yeah. is. Yeah. All right, it's Bonzo. KBA saying that was the first time he had heard his partner's routine. <laughs> What is this is something that I've not always understood. A lot of the times they hold up different fingers when stuff happens, so there KBA held up two. I thought it meant it's the second time he's done that sound. But typically to me that would mean in a round. Or like in a battle so like the first battle he does it second battle he does it again then it's like oh that's the second time you've used that so I don't get how they can do it in their first round all right there's another one he's saying it's dragging on um, another one I've seen a lot is this I don't know what that one is I, my only assumption is they're saying like they're breaking time Thanks. This track has seen better days, but I'm gonna do a shout out to Frosty. Let's go. Um, but yeah, in the comments, let me know if you know any of those 
different hand signals and what they mean. Like some of them may just be for hype. Like I've seen. Oh, right, big up! You know he made himself so thirsty for that. <laughs> I've seen that one All a right. lot, which I think. Sorry, up next we have more. the man himself. You have KBM. Yeah, you know what? Fair good. enough. Already. Uh, yeah. Okay, right. so in three, two, one, loop. So that was a decent round by Bonzo. I don't know much about him. I don't think it really was on par with what PSN put out. <laughs> But also, again, I think part of it may have been some sound was lost due to being online. Because it sounded like there were some dropouts of audio that shouldn't have been there. And I doubt that that was intended. Looks like everybody in the chats heard this. See, and this is like this part right here, just that do, 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 do. He obviously used a second device uh, with a sequencer or something to do that. And PSN does something similar, but with one device, which is what I think people, myself included, don't understand. But I'm excited for this drop. I like what Slether said. Little silver scrapes. Only league players know. No, it's a filter. Okay. Wish that I could go back to it. It was you and me. Now I'm home and all alone it. Now there's misery. Wish that I could go back to it. It was you and me. Now I'm home and all alone it. All I kind of thoughts and That's the uh, quickest way to win me over. Yeah. Dropping audio out. It's always been a like super effective tactic to get me hyped. Like when a metal band drops out all the sound before a breakdown. The pit's about to go insane. I'll tell you that. And that is time. Big R, big R. That was KBA. All right. Let's yeah, go ahead safe. and get very, into very the final safe. round. Looks like Epox right, finally oh, decided to wake up and get out of bed. And collect himself, you know. One second. You in three, two, one, loop. Three, two, one, loop. Doesn't have the same ring as Beatbox. Oh, now Hobbit's got 3D got glasses. I think I saw those earlier. you build in there epos epos right. epos or epos I was on the theme of anime so who likes anime hmm. some i really like others not so much
without that uh okay now that it has this is for all the weeps you <laughs> feels very minecraft the way it's very subdued just something that would be good in the background interview with KBA because like you just got animated mate how do you feel no sound mate I'll meet you oh, oh, I guess he doesn't want to answer the questions and that's fine because you know getting animated is pretty hurtful so like I can understand why he's being a bit quiet about it but you know it is what it is thank you Oh, why didn't he unmute? I wish he unmuted. <laughs> and that is time. What well, a very different battle we've he was had unmuted? indeed. He was Wait, talking. I was trying to unmute, then I realized I was on Ripcord and not Discord. I was really <laughs> on. Oh, no. <laughs> I was talking the entire... I was trying to answer the question. No. Oh, I mean, you can win the battle if you want. Yeah, I, I feel absolutely destroyed. Uh, um, I have no career left. I'm dang. going to go home into the shower and cry. Yeah, uh, do you prefer nice. Uwuska or Nersan thighs? If I'm honest, mate, I don't prefer any of them. Okay, he likes he likes he real women. Their own. Yeah, fair <laughs> enough. <laughs> He's a fuck boy. Okay. All right. Okay. As uh... the new insult I've been seeing on Twitch, uh, Epos needs to go uh, touch grass. It would seem. Um. Anyways, that that aside, I, I I enjoy anime. A lot of my coworkers do as well. I'm not anywhere close to a weeb about it. I've seen like the big ones that I think most people have seen, like uh, Avatar: The Last Airbender, uh, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, Hunter Hunter, um, Death Note, things like that. I started watching One Piece and it was good, but it just was too overwhelming. So in, in terms of content amount, I just couldn't continue watching it. I just was such a big task. Um, but yeah, that being said, it was a cool round. It felt good. That's a lot of, uh, anime weeby music does just kind of have like a positive vibe to it. So it was enjoyable to listen to, but I kind of talked about it at the beginning of this video. I think it was this video. Maybe it was last video. I, I forget sometimes. Sorry. Uh, K-pop, J-pop, all that stuff doesn't really do it for me. Because, again, 
I'm very lyrical driven in my music tastes. And when I can't understand a word you're saying, it kind of ruins it for me unless the words are meant to kind of just augment the song. Like, um, uh, trying to think like i know kanye does it sometimes where he'll put out like unreleased stuff where he's just kind of like that poop diddy scoop poop de scoop de poop stuff like that where he's just kind of playing around with sounds rather than actual words to try and feel out how he wants the flow of the song to sound stuff like that i think is interesting but um anyways that being said, I mean, like I said, I think Bonzo's round was pretty good, but it didn't really compete with PSNs. Similarly, Epos's round was pretty good, but I don't feel like it competed with KBAs. So I'm definitely giving it to KBA and PSN. Um, I see this is just the semifinal. I think that's what a half final is. So there must be another finals after this. So maybe I'll check that out next to see who won and who won the competition. Um, in fact, maybe they say here, eh, doesn't look like it. Uh, as always, if you've made it this far in the video though, please don't forget to like and comment on my video as well as the original channel and the loopers involved. I'll try to include links to all their channels down in the description, but, uh, as always, thanks for tuning in and, uh, I will see you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. Oh, well, there's an awkward outro. I couldn't find my stop button. Bye.